Hello, welcome to Straw Family Farm Take Two. I'm Christy. Today in the chapel, we've got Ephesians 6, 24. Grace to all who love our Lord Jesus Christ with an undying love. So, just look at that grace. So, anyway. Um, yeah, it's been one of those weeks. All right. For the crocheting, I don't have a whole lot. Um, I did work on this little guy. It, it's coming along. Um, but I've had a little issue. Uh, I don't know if I told you this. So this one is the wavy, but I'm holding on to my thing. When I went to start this, it is nothing but yarn barf in there. And I found two ends. I don't know if I told you guys that or not. So this is like rolling around. And the first time in my life, I'm thinking I need a yarn bowl. Just say it. Um, because... I can't do anything but from the outside. So it's kind of discouraging me to um, work on that one just because I don't want to have to deal with that. But I'm probably going to. Uh, the other thing, and a lot of this I just can't remember. Um, it's been an emotional week. Just So I know I was working on the slippers. We talked about the kit with the pink kitten pillow. And I talked to RJ, and I was like, if they do stuff like that again, I'm probably going to cancel the kids. I, I don't do toys. Okay. But I do have two full sets of these. I don't have any of the ends woven in, but I have two full sets. Now, I need to make two more sets. I will have enough yarn. But the problem is, is that these are for Mother's Day, and Easter's coming before Mother's Day. So, all right. And the final thing that I'm working on is I'm making 24 of the little chicks for work. Now it'll have a little comb. I've got my little thing here with giggly eyes. It'll have the red comb and the little beak. And I haven't sewed them in yet. I still have, I'm doing them in steps. Um, I think I still got three more to do. But I've got this one half done. So two and a head. Because I'm where I'm joining the head. So two and a head of those left to do. And I did some white ones. I've even got the tails all on them. And I, I need to trim the tails and comb them out. But for right now, I'm working on those. And then I've just got to fill those eggs. And I'll be ready for Easter for work. Um, so... Just working on little things. Honestly, um, I sewed more this weekend than I have in a long time. Um, a roommate had an abscess tooth. Roommate was a bear. Um, just didn't want anything to do with anybody. Don't make any noise. Don't. Yeah. The dogs had a problem with that. But uh, roommate got into the dentist yesterday at like two, which is Monday. Tuesday. Um, today I have to go to work early for our monthly meeting. And with everything that's going on in banking, it's going to be one of those. Uh, so, um, yeah, just been, uh, in RJ's world, he sold the big trailer. So I know that doesn't mean much to you guys, but it means my payment is going down. Um, the big trailer, he used it for the first year and a half, real hot and heavy. And then after that, gas prices went so high and and things just got out of control. And, you know, um, we got that right before 2020. Yeah. And so he used it pretty hot and heavy. Um, he sold it to a guy down in Texas. Guy came up, picked it up this Friday or last Friday, however you want to say it. Today's Tuesday, so four or five days ago. Um, and my car is the last thing on that note, and it's that payment's going to go way down, so I should be able to get some of the things paid off. And RJ, um, his father lives with him, and he, uh, his father got a different job. They've got everything caught up. Things are just starting seem like a blessing. I know everything's a blessing, but um, things are getting 
back to where they were before all the truck stuff happened. If you remember, we didn't have a whole lot of problems until we were making truck payment. And then once the truck went out, this went out and that went out. And then the trailer had to have a new floor. And just one thing after another. And unfortunately in farming, <clears throat> you don't have ready cash. So, um, yeah, I've got everything paid off except for my car and one personal thing. And then once I get that paid off, then I will start paying off on RJ stuff. Um, his dad just has um, their house note. You know, it's mine too. It's got my name on it. I pay part of that already. Um, it's only fair. So it's got my name on it. I owe on it. So I pay part of that now. Um, so his dad just has the house bills and that. And then RJ has uh, the truck payment and that from where the whole truck debacle thing. So I'm going to help him pay off those. And I'm hoping to be able to pay off. I think he's got a little bitty credit card that he uses his gas on every month. And he got to a point this winter where he wasn't able to pay it off every month. It's just a couple hundred dollars. It, it's, like, you know, so I'm going to pay that one off. And I may be able to pay that one off early. But anyway, so that will help him. He will have all of his stuff taken care of. And in the next year, everything should get uh, lined out and get a little bit better off. Um so we can just get rid of the truck payments. I'm telling you. <laughs> so get it back down to just the house payment. I like that. You know, the household payments, the house payment, be done with it. So, um, yeah. But uh, anyway, his dad got a different job. Um, he's doing decent. He's got a month to try it out. And then because he had so much leave from Walmart that he's still getting paid. He's going to try this other job out at the end of the 30 days. If he doesn't like it, he's going to go back to Walmart. So, um, yeah, there's that going on. RJ's life is, is he thinks is all for the better. So, um, and like I said, I have, um, some things that paid off and that'll loosen up some things. So all of that's going on last week. I just, uh, it was just, I don't know, just a rough week. I have a sinus headache and just emotionally, bleh. so I know that doesn't sound too great, but I just, you know, had to stay away from roommate. The dogs even got on roommate's nerves. So um, roommate was just hurting and, and I get it, you know, an abscess tooth is not fun, but uh, I stayed pretty much in here. My crochet was in the other room. So I just did a ton of sewing. Um, so if you watch the sewing part, I got a lot going on there. <laughs> uh, but other than that, I do have to get ready for work. I have got um, to be to work early. I did decide one thing, and that is I'm going to draw again for that prize that um, we had for the 2000 giveaway. Okay. Um, if you want your name in that second drawing, comment below and let me know uh so and it, even if you didn't put in for the first one if you want to try and get on the second drawing go for it you know just comment below um don't care what your comments say you know i used to put a theme to them and say oh comment about your favorite craft or comment about your fit i don't care just make a comment below and then if you win it make sure you contact me by email so anyway all right i'm gonna get off of here and go get ready for work it is raining cats and dogs outside. My clothes are in the dryer. I'm not pressing them today. I'm just throwing them in the dryer with a wet rag. Praying for the best. Uh, yeah, I'm going to go get dressed. Get my eyes on. and uh, Oh, and I have an eye doctor appointment coming up too. So Yeah, that's Thursday, I think. Anyway, alright, I'm off of here. Uh, comment below for the drawing and I will see you in the sewing section. Bye.